Hello students, welcome back to my channel. Today's so, question is solve d square plus d minus six under bracket into y is equal to x. This is a non-homogeneous linear differential equation. So first write solution, then write the given, the given equation. Equation is in symbolic form. Okay, why I am telling symbolic form means it is here d is given. D means symbolic form. Okay. Write first statement okay symbolic form after what you will do write first question okay d square plus d minus 6 under bracket into y is equal to x now write this uh, now there are three steps to solve this question so first step is to find the complementary function second step to find the particular integral third time to find the general solution so first step one okay step one okay step one is complementary function okay so first for complementary function what you do i take lhs side lhs side what is there is d square plus d minus 6 under bracket into y is equal to now we don't consider uh, rhs anything is given in complementary function we consider consider as zero okay now if we send y to this this side you become zero so we equation is d square plus d minus 6 6 is equal to zero now write this equation in auxiliary form so right here statement right in auxiliary form okay auxiliary form okay auxiliary form is what i will do instead of d i write m okay to find the roots okay always my auxiliary form is here in i'm changing instead of d replacing m here okay so m square plus m minus 6 is equal to 0 now we have to find the factors by middle term studying method so you can write as a minus 6 factors are 3 2 the 6 plus 3 and minus 2 to get the here plus 1 we have to write plus 3 and minus 2 okay so m square plus 3m minus 2m minus 6 is equal to 0 now you take m as common so m under bracket m minus m plus 3 here take minus 2 outside so m plus t it means our factors are correct okay now take m plus t as common here so m plus 3 okay now what is remaining also taking bracket become m minus 2 equal to 0 now separate equate this uh, is 0 with this function so m plus 3 is equal to 0 m minus 2 is equal to 0 now what will become our m1 value is if we send plus is equal to minus 3 what is equal to minus 3 now m2 is equal to if you send plus or minus this side to come plus 2 okay now write the case the roots are different okay write the other statement the roots are different okay different means the uh, the values are different minus and positive minus 3 and plus 2 okay different if signs are same but uh, numbers are different but also it is different if signs are same and numbers also same, then we can say the roots are equal so y is equal to a into e power m1 x plus b into e power m2 x now right our complementary function is a into e power what is m1 is minus, minus 3 x plus b into e power what is m2 is plus 2 x 2 plus 2 x is our complementary function we just only found out our step one which is complementary function now step two okay step Two, okay step two is what to find a particular integral okay pi this is a short form p dot i now in question also you will tell find the pi pi means particular integral so right so right here pi formula pi is equal to x by f of d okay f of d now in what is x this is x and this is f of d and this is y okay so what is x x is x only here x is under time running x like what is f of d d square d square plus d minus 6 okay now take x y now here minus 6 take outside um, and take a common here so okay minus 6 into into 1 minus d by 6 minus d square by 6 okay so if you have also if you multiply then also the equation will become here same only okay i'm just multiplying dividing by 6 here okay now what will happen here uh, you will take here common okay x by minus 6 under bracket 1 minus minus take here common outside under bracket become d plus d square by 6 
and our agi now what you will do you take uh, here a minus 6 or it will become minus 1 by 6 and by 6 x by 1 minus b plus d square by 6 okay now i am writing uh, in another page you better to understand to you now see where i am here now here now send this one minus d plus d square by six upside will become inverse here okay it will become here inverse okay i'm so i'm writing here okay here so it become one minus one by six uh, under bracket one sorry under bracket 1 minus under bracket d plus d square by 6 in the bracket into inverse into x okay so here see simply what i did sending this 1 minus under bracket d plus d square by 6 to a this will become that values are don't change okay i am multiplying here it will go upside it will multiply here now i am using which case here i am using which case means which case i am using means by using by using using 1 minus d inverse so it become 1 plus d plus d square plus d cube okay so here neglect now write another statement here neglect neglect x what will they neglect here d square and d cube okay why i'm neglecting means here explore what is there nothing there we are considering so you have to write till here only so what did become minus 1 by 6 under bracket 1 this is this is this is 1 and this is minus minus then the, this one this whole function is the in formula okay don't get convenience i'm writing simply in this not okay 1 minus this d minus under bracket d plus d square by 6 okay this is 6 not 0 6 and a bracket okay into x now separately divide this so it become minus 1 by 6 and a bracket 1 minus d by 6 plus d square by 6 okay into x not square here into x now what we will do now you will multiply this into x now d means now always understand d means differentiate okay differentiate differentiate means divide x and d, d square means double time double time differentiate okay differentiate this short form okay so it will become minus 1 by 6 1 into a, 1 into x is x okay minus now here take uh, 1 by 6 outside minus 1 by 6 now d by dx of x d by dx of x is equal to 1 so it become here 1 then what next what will happen here uh, sorry here plus i forgot to here one plus okay here also plus sorry six into one here formula there that's why i'm changing don't be get confused i'm writing here minus min plus here formula there one plus d okay and uh, now then plus now here take one by six outside here one by six now d by dx of d x square okay double time differentiate we first time differentiate now d by dx of one is equal to zero okay so it becomes zero now what is our answer is minus 1 by 6 into x plus x plus 1 by 6 okay after what you will do hmm, cross multiply here okay so it become minus 1 by 6 flower bracket 6 x plus 1 by 6 okay now send the 6 to in inside so our particular integral is pi is equal to my uh, pi is equal to minus 1 by 36 so simply multiplying and taking out eh, into 6 x plus 1 okay this is our this is our particular integral. now what we'll do next you will write here as now the general solution step 2 step 3 okay step 3 you got to find the general solution the right the general solution is the general solution is is what is general solution is there y is equal to complementary function 
plus particular integral okay so y is equal to now what is component function now we just found out a into e power minus 3x minus 3x plus b into e power 2x then here minus the that's why i'm writing minus here plus a but i have to write minus minus 1 by 36 and the bracket 6x plus 1 okay this is our general solution this is our answer thanks for watching